Let's talk about rate of return. If you're thinking about being an adult, investing could be a huge help because let's face it, pizza isn't cheap and neither are the bills. Wouldn't it be nice to have some extra money to cover the expenses? To really understand how much money you'll be earning through investing, you'll need to get familiar with the after-tax real rate of return. When you invest money, you can typically expect to make a certain amount of profit over time. This is called the rate of return. When you withdraw your investment, you might wonder why there's not quite as much return as you thought. This is where the after-tax real rate of return comes in. It's your rate of return with two extra things factored in, taxes and inflation. First, there's taxes. Since the profit from an investment is technically income, you have to pay a little to the government. Your taxes are based off of your earnings and the percentages are already set. At the same time, you have to deal with inflation. Inflation is how prices increase for the same goods and services over time. When inflation rises, the buying power of your money goes down. Inflation doesn't actually change the amount of money you receive, it just makes that money worth less. Now that Uncle Sam has taken part of your investment and inflation has decreased the buying power of your money, what you have left is the after-tax real rate of return. It's not so bad though. It's still more than you started out with. And you're one step closer to your goals.